I am recording. Electric car. Are you scared of my electric car? Can go to you. I Yeah. Well, I guess there by stair, I guess. Or I could just take a shortcut and just jump. Yo, that's just OP. I just, I just took a shortcut. Stop. I like doing the magma admin, but it's time to use the magma admin. I want to use Sky Island. No, 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 no. So I'm gonna have to defeat. Get away from my chest. Nobody can get the cake. I already have a cake. I don't want to kill. Yeah, I don't want to kill. Gonna, I don't think I'm gonna be able to grind here. I don't want to. Really I'm just gonna leave. I'm just gonna go to a different game. Why? People, right? Yeah, people. Right. So I left your game. Okay. I got the one, the electric ultimate com. Yes, let's go, chest. Another chest, let's go. I know, I already know where all the chests are. Do you know any other chests that are right here? Uh, yep, a bunch. You also need a powerful fruit to get up there. Like a strong fruit, a real strong fruit, a real strong fruit. No cap. Epic. I actually don't want to go to the underwater city because it's like um something happens. Is that the upper layer? Yeah, that's a, that's a top top. I'm gonna, I'm gonna check it out. I'm gonna look. Yeah, that, that's, that's where Suki goes. That's the island that he goes. Did you fart it? No. So. Make all my stats equal. I mostly put in fruit because fruit is powerful. And I'm thinking about getting a new fruit. The best fruit that I got was control. But suck for my level. Because I was like a the island of pirate. The pirate village, yeah, pirate village. So, I need to quit my cape. Get this thing out. So, I need the coat. I like the coat. Actually, I don't have the battle pass. So, I can't go here. But I do have the sleigh, so I can go from here. Because the sleigh is a fast boat. 
This is my next island, but so far away. So I'm not bothered to go to the island. I should go to that island, yeah, that island. I want to do something with you. Shakira. So, I'm gonna secretly do this thing. He doesn't know that. <coughs> But I can share maybe for this for my hand. Because I have an electric car, but I don't really like to upgrade okay my But now I do because I like it. And I go to... I like to do the soldiers. Because they're like... I'm not sure. I do that. 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 I I know you miss home, but I'm going to go. 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 Tornado. I'm going to fly. I actually like to do this style. Final one. I'll finish you off. Yeah. What? Done. Another one. And I do that. We have to get back up. Not that. No wrong move. Hold on a minute, sugar. Um. Come here. Come on. Where you going? Where you going? Where you going? Gas and one just gas with her. And then helicopter style. Helicopter. Helicopter. Make sure don't do what I just did. Because it was the wrong thing. Actually, the wind, actually the wind world, this is pretty good. Yeah, can you that last Quest completed, but I didn't get any levels. Muda like you, button. Can't even hit him, finally. Helicopter style. Helicopter, helicopter, helicopter. Uh, I think it's enough. Alhamdulillah, Jazakumullah Khairah. Now we prepare to listen the training. Uh, Insyaallah, Pak Bas. Training. Jamaah-jamaah uh, yang di luar Sydney yang masoleh biasa demonya untuk mendengarkan kita ada training PCR dari. Uh, I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do it. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do it. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do it. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do it. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do it. I'm not sure if you're going to
This is the training. What? CPR? Stop trying to play anime. Why are we going to trade CPR? Well, no I sense. don't know. Just Well, it is what it is, Zayd. Why training CPR? Well, he says it doesn't make any sense. He says he says training CPR. Training. Oh, I thought you said. Uh, they're gonna learn how to do CPR then. They're learning how to do CPR. <laughs> Who is that girl? Uh, you know, I just do CPR. Yeah. I do like. Is it like a training? So the or So how does CPR? You had to push the tummy very hard. The way to the CPR, you got to push the tummy really hard. But no, but that's what I said. Also, if you want to do CPR, you have to push it to me very hard. <laughs> That's so, so, so <laughs> I'm going to talk to you that one. If you want to learn how to do CPR, you have to push it to me very hard. Stop saying that. I didn't do anything. I know it's that. <laughs> Abba, why they training CPR? Oh, is that like a professional that comes? Do yeah. you know CPR? Is? No. You know CPR? Well, no. CPR is very important for help when people go in the hospital for help them get to while they're in the ambulance. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Can I have your attention, please? Alhamdulillah, You went on robbing a house. You went on robbing a house. I want the people with magical weapons when they come into your house when they rob it. But they try to break the door. What was it? Was it? Was it with their heads are too weak to open the door? See every open of There's nothing in there. Our prophets ask us to maintain our health. Is it now? How much is it? Why does everybody want to be by allies? Oh, yeah, true. People keep asking to be Except you, because there's millions of allies. Aida already agreed. Who's in the top in leaderboard? Uh, they, so, do you uh, know where that was? It? Do you know oh, where yeah. the chest Do you know the yeah, inventory is in this island? island? Huh? Um, is there an inventory? Yeah, no, no, no. I know. I know. Tell me which island is it. Just give me. I know. It's, I could do a magic uh, easy. Okay? Not there. Turn around. Turn around. Go to that cloudy island. Um, yeah, that one, that one, that one. Up there, up there. So basically, if you just scan it, there's a QR code on the survey, and if you just scan it, the survey will come up. Um, so basically, the reason why we're asking you to do that is because we want to get an idea of your understanding around CPR. Go to the, go to the big, the big one. This one. 
Yeah. Uh, if you've done CPR okay. before, and that's uh, really and then important to hit us the cloud. for um, getting knowledge. And then about you how teleport to, to the top. And, how to implement it in the future. Yeah. Cool. Cool. Um, and then so you can see the MZ code. What? I should have been there before. That would be really appreciated. Right. Because it's a different place. It's up there. But you, but you go through the bottom one. Thanks, Lyle. See? So, uh, oh, wait. Yeah, so yeah, you're through the up one. Straight oh, to the main part the of one? this uh, presentation. So, uh, okay, I'm not ready uh, for this one. Mind. I'm not ready Everyone's, for this one. Uh, <laughs> you almost died. This is a program that has been agreed by Ida, Ida for members. I don't want to use the saber anymore. Saber is trash. Saber is trashy. Now, uh, I'll give that to Julie. Sorry. <laughs> Alright, okay, that's fine. That even fall there. Oh, so, uh, maybe, um, Sorry. Friend, maybe, no, it's alright. So, basically, we... If you want to do CPR, you have to do shit down. And it's something people attending in, in person here. I can't stop laughing. Okay, I'm ready now. Melbourne, I'm just gonna go here. Medelaide, what? 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 Nani? 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 If you want to put this out, if you want to put it out, do you see the eye? Do we have someone in uh, Rarotonga? No, I don't think so. So we have a, you know, we also uh, cover Rarotonga as well, but it's too far at the moment. Let's do it already, and maybe it's doing afternoon now. If you want to learn how to do it, do it. Stop talking about it. Oh, sorry, that's so <laughs> Before there was a fly! Oh, so this, oh, so this is the low level one, right? Huh? Yeah, the low level one. Oh, yes, money. You just teleported up there. Really? To the top island, yeah. Oh, you mean that one? Yeah, you just teleported there. So, I could've just used that bit just to get there? Instead of having the fly up there? Yeah. Well, that's right. But oh, yeah. It's only for Chest. people who don't, who don't have a flying thing. Oh no! You couldn't go through the stairs. I'm too lazy. That makes stairs. <laughs> that makes stairs. Oh, example. Oh, see, look, there's an example. <laughs> okay. Hello, everyone. Um, my name's uh, I'm head going. Um, my name is Julie Hughes, and I represent the Michael Hughes Foundation. Um, and I'll tell you a little bit more about that in the next couple of slides. Um, so today's session is brought to you by the Westmead Applied Research Centre. And we're doing a big community engagement survey uh, regarding CPR and encouraging community members uh, to be able to step in and do something before the ambulance arrives. <coughs> so um, I hope you enjoy the session. Um, I will be doing some practical demonstrations of CPR and using a defibrillator, so I'm hoping that everyone might be able to see, um, but I'll make sure that we can do both sides of the room. So the Michael Hughes Foundation, um, so we were established as an organisation in 2013, um, sorry, 2015, um, and our core mission is to turn bystanders into first responders in medical emergencies. Um, we have eight board of directors and four major patrons who represent us, and we're all about raising awareness of what cardiac arrest is. We are about increasing defibrillators in the community, and you might have seen them in workplaces, sports clubs, and those kind of things, shopping centres. Um, we provide education, so a session like this today is very core to who we are, and we're about um, advocacy, and also, most importantly to me, is creating a legacy for Michael <coughs> Hughes, who's pictured here. If Michael you want to husband, do CPR, you can to the next universe. So he was only 38 years of age. Okay, oh, so um, this happened at home, 
It happened very unexpectedly. And for me personally, I was the first responder to that. So the things that I'm teaching you today, I've had a personal experience in. And the, um, the organisation was brought together primarily to kind of um, um, answer all the questions <laughs> that come in with someone so unexpectedly and also so young. Um, so our organisation has a lived experience <laughs> has a lived experience of cardiac arrest and we have a lot of insight and knowledge from the perspective of responders, paramedics, um, survivors of cardiac arrest and families who've lost some loved ones this year. Um, so just to give you a little bit of background who I am and also the Michael Hughes Foundation. So as I said before, FIRST CPR is a really, really important research project and we're thrilled to be part of it. It's a community group targeted health promotion um, intervention to help increase willingness and confidence among community members to respond to out-of-hospital cardiac arrest. Each and every one of you here today has the opportunity to help save a life and there are very simple skills that are required to be able to do that and every single one of you here today, no matter how old you are or how old you are, can do that. So does everyone, one of my first questions I need to ask, has everyone done first aid training in the past? Can you put up your hand if you've done a, an accredited first aid course, CPR course? Nope. Have got big <laughs> Um, and has everyone done a first aid, a CPR, a course of CPR course in the last 12 months? No? I've never done any CPR thing in my life. Now, does never. everyone know what a cardiac arrest is? If I had to ask you today, do you know what a cardiac arrest is? Would anyone be able to answer that question? Nope. Mm -hmm. You're saying heart? Yeah, definitely about heart. <laughs> considered clinically dead and so action is required to reverse that. If nothing is done for that person, the person will pass away. Okay, so it's a very, very critical medical event that you need to attend to. Um, with a, what um, a heart attack, you do have signs, you mean? do have warning signs. Oh, somebody um, the person is conscious of breathing. That I literally saw well. you. I'm not sure if you've had Oh no, that, that was someone that you never um, seen before. Men and women. Mm. I literally saw your hand. You did take yeah, a photo of me, Alex. You said, obviously. Nico, me, right? That was not me. Sorry. Who was that? Did you have people there to help know. you? Yeah, there was a lot of people there to help you. Where were you? Okay, I'm just going to go back to the hospital. I'm listening. Okay. Oh, wow. So you saved your life. No, you did you. I did not hear you. I still have him, but he's really My camera is everywhere. There's cameras everywhere. So you only took one of the cameras out. Okay, so on And that was the like the the bad uh, camera. Unconscious and not responding and not breathing normally. So in, when you do a first aid course, there are some of the first things that you'll be taught that was not me. about that was not me. Um, breathing and consciousness and the things to How can I nearly I nearly, nearly go and try with them? So again, heart attack, conscious and breathing showing that was symptoms, me. cardiac arrest, please unconscious me, and not please breathing me. normally. And both no, not me. Who that? The, oh, 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 he's <laughs> <and really sorry, laughs> <for those. laughs> Uh, 
Yeah, just show you the working He started hitting me crazy. He started hitting me into the next universe. Was he the crying? I like This is nice. You should get flipped in the eye. So the role of CPR is to manually make the heart work. And the defibrillator, which is the little machine, you better the manicure, tell the truth. Because you, shock you could do a very hard to the, the next universe. So you better don't. Free candy? So the two have to work Free candy? Does that make sense? I'm just kidding. Can I do the same cookie? Okay. Well, if you don't have any questions, you can put your hands up and ask as we go through. Yeah, cookie. Uh, uh, right, so the statistics in Australia it's are pretty it's bad. It's not real. It's a mechanism you can just move. Oh, okay, I just move. I'll go first. But if I talk it, I have to move. So I move. I don't know if you can hear me. Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, so the statistics in Australia are pretty bad. Okay, so the statistics in Australia are pretty bad. Okay, so the statistics you might need to respond. It's probably someone that free spin. Okay, I see so what I get with my shoes. Um, that's better. When a cardiac arrest happens, that's better. One in ten people survive. But there's a huge amount of people who pass away. And it's a lot of times there's a, a number of elements that come in, but the number one factor for survival normally comes to down to time, okay? Now, there is nine, um, the average response time of an ambulance... Was he from the box is here? Huh? No, it's just a game. Um, the box is here. We're not in the same game. So Did you just draw my game? I said I'm just I'm flexing you. So it's airway, having a look in the person's throat and mouth, 
to see if anything is um, in there and trying to get it out. That could be food, it could be blood, it could be vomit. And I know that sounds terrible, but if you can try and get that out. And then it's looking for normal breathing, so normal rise and fall of the chest, like we're all doing now. But as we said before, to recognise a cardiac as someone who's unconscious and not breathing normally. And if that's the case, then you need to start CPR and use a defibrillator if one is handy, okay? And with each of those, you should not feel fearful to do that, okay? So it's important for you to have some level of confidence that you can help save a life by these simple steps. If a defibrillator is not available, okay, or not nearby, don't worry about it. You just ring to the zero and have them on the phone and just do CPR. Okay, CPR is so totally and we'll go through that now. Um, does anyone have any concerns about Shall being you sued? Shall you do something? Um, is She's doing something fear? wrong with CPR? Is that a fear or barrier for anyone to start? Yeah? Okay. Um, it's a common question that does come up and sometimes is a barrier for people to start doing um, first aid and also CPR. So we wanted to cover that in New South Wales, 